For the weekend, the holidays can be a hectic time of year. Not telling you anything new, kind of Captain Obvious here. But if you're looking to get away this weekend and get away from the frenzy, Discover Oklahoma may have the perfect spot for you and your family. Deanne Stein shows us a peaceful place near Lake Eufaula, literally in the trees. The drive to our getaway is definitely off the beaten path. GPS doesn't do well, so we have to meet our guests and, and have them follow us. So we followed our host, Richard Shelton, to our secluded location. Yeah, it is remote, uh, but it's only about eight miles from town. My teenage daughter and I were not disappointed when we finally saw the accommodations up in the trees. The most fun is when, when uh, people come out here with kids and just to see the kids' eyes light up when they come out. The Eufaula Treehouse Tree Sort has two tree houses for rent. We stayed in the Hummingbird, which sleeps four, a queen bed on the main floor, and a full bed in the loft. Well, you know, each tree house, you know, it does have a, a running water full bathroom. Uh, you know, and you have a refrigerator and microwave. And heat and air. There is also a nice deck overlooking the property. A lot of people really enjoy just to, to unplug and, and get out here in nature and relax. Unplug we did. Of course, I didn't tell my daughter until we got here. She took it all in stride, though, and experienced wow. some of the fun at hand. Oh. And a lot of people really like the fact that they can unplug and have their kids unplug and just have good family time. Um, you know, and a lot of people just like to, to be out in nature. The space offers a fire pit and charcoal grill and a picnic table. Richard and his wife Becky also provide outdoor fun like horseshoes and cornhole. To relax, you can hang out in a hammock or the tree swing. And with the Eufaula and the lake nearby, there is plenty to do within minutes of the treehouse. Discover Oklahoma airs at 630 tomorrow night right after our evening newscast.